Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I haven't seen you guys in about, uh, I think 12 days it said. So that's a long ass time for me because I was uploading two times a day. Not really, but I was uploading daily, three, four times a week. But obviously guys, it's gotten cold. So today's video guys, if you haven't read the title, we're going to talk about plans for the channel over the winter and plans for the GTI for the winter. So without further ado, let's get into it. Let's go look at the GTI quick. Whew. All right guys, so the GTI, GTI has been sitting here for about a week. I ended up taking insurance off of it, so that's kind of sad. But here it is, guys. You know, still rocking the JNC. All right, you guys see the fucking car. As I mentioned, GTI has been sitting for about a week now, maybe two weeks. Um, but yeah, haven't really driven it much at all because I'm not supposed to. Driven the GTI or the Civic, whatever. You know what it is. GTI sitting. I'm not driving it. So let's get into what we're gonna do on the channel content wise what you can expect for the next three or four months number one we're gonna mod the gti we're gonna mod the shit out of it no, i'm just kidding not really but we're gonna mod the gti so we're gonna you know obviously i'm gonna record you know videos of me you know installing parts probably talking about the parts giving my review thinks thoughts about it whether or not you guys should even do it um i want to talk about that later here what i plan to do but whether or not you guys should even spend the money doing stuff like that and if you already have stuff and you know all about gtis well we can, you know, see if we agree. And then not, not just that, guys, but I also really want to get into uh, maybe some car commentary, some racing commentary. I know you guys like Mexico videos. And I think it'd be fun to, like, have commentary over uh, the racing videos that, you know, are either posted on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, whatever. Anything I run into, obviously, I'm going to give credit to the people that, uh, you know, did the runs or if they have an IG page or a YouTube page. Definitely got to give credit where credit's due. I don't like it when somebody uses my video and uh, doesn't give me credit. Drew Peacock, mother of God, just kidding. <laughs> no, but for real, like, I actually was on a Drew Peacock video. He was doing that, he was doing commentary over runs, and I was like, bruh, he's not funny. Okay, he's kind of funny, but I didn't realize he was supposed to be trying to be funny, but I don't know. Anyway, I thought, you know what, that'd be kind of fun to do, so I'm gonna do that, and we're gonna do it, and we're gonna do it better, and we're gonna have better runs. So that's gonna, so we're gonna do that as well. Um, any random vlogs that, you know, maybe, you know, Christmas coming up, maybe fun, you know, I'll show you guys what I got for Christmas. I got, you know, some car parts on my list, so I'm probably going to do that. I think that'd be fun to uh, vlog and show you guys what I got and shit like that, man. I don't know, but yeah, guys, life updates, maybe some top fives, you know, how much cost of ownership, stuff like that. Um, I got a list of the stuff here that I kind of plan to do, but definitely got to get a little more creative now that Mexico is pretty much over. Um, you know, maybe I'll get some run, you know, maybe I'll actually go out and I'll ride with somebody. I mean, it's been decent out. It's already like late November 29th and, uh, yeah, man, I mean, it's the weather this weekend was good and people went out. I didn't have insurance and my brakes are dead, so I'm not going to do that. But so yeah, that's kind of what the plans are for the, for the content side. So number one, I want to get a center exit exhaust. I put it, I, I put a poll on my Instagram and most people didn't like it, but it was kind of close, but a lot of people didn't like it. Some people did, so it's kind of like mixed, but I like it, so I'm gonna do it. I just wanted to see what people would think. Um, but essentially, we're gonna get the Allied Express rear diffuser. I don't even know where that ships from. It's like $80 shipping, bro. So anyway, it's got, you know, it's a nice rear diffuser. Got the two meant for a center exit. Pretty sure I'd have to just get a center exit, uh, like custom made, and then get the big ass four inch tips or four and a half inch. I don't know, the one that is right here, that's what I want it to look like. I think it'd be dope. It might be a little weird, I think it looks nice and then i'm thinking about maybe switching out the jnc wheels i know they look nice but i think they're actually like, they're so heavy man they're slowing me down i don't know if they are but they feel really heavy so i'm thinking about switching them up selling my oems austin's selling these and then using that money to fund uh some nkrpf ones thinking about going 18 by 9 the 35 offset on some toyo r triple eights that'd be good Moving forward, adding on to the cosmetic deal, I want to get a rear extension or what is it, a spoiler extension from Maxton or Aerofab, and then I want to get the just the front lip or a front splitter, whatever you want to call it. I don't know which one; they all look the same. Not really, but GTIs have such a shitty like market for them. But probably gonna go something cheaper. Don't need the $350 Maxton to rip on me when I'm driving. 
uh, and hit a pothole, and then it breaks, and then I'm like, Pop. And last but not least, guys, I got, you know, I got maybe, 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 if, well, first of all, if I can afford it, second of all, if this, no, first of all, if this dude can, wants to give it to me, second of all, if I can afford it, but my guy might sell me his kit to be fast, fast. I don't know if he's for real about it. If he's not, you know, whatever. But, I don't know. We'll see. So essentially a, it's a the Vortex XL Turbo with all the supporting mods and Axe support and fully 85 tune. Good for like over 500. That'd be dope, but I don't know if it's gonna happen. If it doesn't happen, I'm really thinking about just going full E85 on my IS-38, maxing that thing out, seeing how much you can put down and uh, hopefully hit them high in eights, 60 to 130s. Yeah guys, so that's gonna do it. That's pretty much what we got planned here. Make sure you guys subscribe. It helps me a lot. Not really, it doesn't help me at all, but it helps, you know, it helps the algorithm if you like the video. If you subscribe, if you comment, you know, it helps, you know, get more exposure out there into the world of YouTube, which, you know, it's a small channel, guys. We're 1.4 thousand, was I say million? No, 1.4 thousand, which is like nothing in this world, but, I'm still trying to get up there. We're still trying to grow. I want you guys to come with me. So, let's get let's get to it. You know, you guys think this is dumb. Good ideas, bad ideas of what I'm doing, my content. Let me know if you guys have any ideas of what you want to see. But that's what's coming for sure. See you guys later. Peace.